10 or 15 years ago, I had a young man come in and he was from a different part of the state. He had, he had traveled two and a half hours and he just was not having fun. Mm. And he had this folder of information and just everything, every diamond he had ever seen. And, mm -hmm. and I got to asking him, I said, you know, what's, what's going on? You know, what you're not, you should enjoy this. This is an exciting time in your life. And he said, and I've been to 15 different jewelry stores and it was just going through and this person says this and this person says this and you say this. And I said, can I just give you some advice? And he said, yeah, I said, you have to stop. You have to stop going to stores. You have to stop looking everything up and micro analyzing everything. I said, I've done this at that point, 15 years less than I've done it now, right? <laughs> I said, I buy diamonds all the time and they always look different in person than they do on paper. I'll go to buy one for somebody and I'll have a description of it. And when I get it, I'm like, mm, not so much, mm. you know? And so you do at some point just have to look at the diamond and experience the diamond because that's why somebody over researches. They don't want to make a poor decision, right? We get that. We're not going to let you do that, but too much research. You'll know when you get there, when it becomes un not enjoyable. And if you're making it transactional instead of about the purpose, uh, that, that to me is where you'll know.